हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग आई एम धीरेन्द्र कुमार मॉडर्न इंग्लिश स्कूल न्यू एरिया सीनियर में दिस इज सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ वीडियो लेक्चर फॉर क्लास एट हिस्ट्री चैप्टर सिक्स कॉलोनालिज एंड द सिटी स्टूडेंट टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द मेकिंग ऑफ न्यू दिल्ली स्टूडेंट इन एटीन जीरो थ्री ब्रिटिश गेन कंट्रोल ऑन दिल्ली आफ्टर डिफ्टिंग मराठा एज कैपिटल ऑफ इंडिया वॉज इन कोलकाता मुगल एम्पर वे आर एलॉट टू रिसाइड इन रेड फोर्ट दिल्ली वॉज मेड एज न्यू दिल्ली ओनली आफ्टर नाइनटीन इलेवन वेन कैपिटल फ्रॉम कलकत्ता ट्रांसफर्ड टू दिल्ली स्टूडेंट वेन कैपिटल ऑफ इंडिया वॉज ट्रांसफर्ड फ्रॉम कलकत्ता टू दिल्ली इट वॉज रिक्वायर्ड टू मॉडर्नाइज दिल्ली British wanted to demolish the past. Let us see how they demolished the past. Student, Delhi was developed, but development was different from the cities such as. Madras, Calcutta, and Bombay. In these cities, British live apart from, far away from Indians. There were white town and black towns. In black towns, Indians were allowed to live. while british lived in well developed well laid out cities that was called white town in delhi british used to live with wealthy indian in walled cities they also participated in indian festivals they enjoyed urdu and persian with indians i mean to say that in presidencies british live apart from india but in delhi both means british and indian lived together they also interact with each other the british took part in indian festivals student in 1897 in 1797 delhi college was established after the establishment of this college art and science was developed in delhi so this time means 1830 to 1857 time period between 1830 to 1857 is referred as renaissance renaissance punarjagran what is renaissance renaissance Rebirth of art. 
एंड साइंस स्टूडेंट ऑल द थिंग्स वे आर गोइंग ऑन वेरी वेल बट एज वी नो दैट ड्यूरिंग एटीन फिफ्टी सेवन रिवॉल्ट दिल्ली हैड बीन अंडर कंट्रोल ऑफ रिवेलियन फॉर फोर मंथस वेन ब्रिटिश गेन कंट्रोल ऑन दिल्ली दे वेयर फुल ऑफ रिवेंज दे वेयर वेरी एंग्री दे वॉन्टेड टू टेक रिवेंज वेन दे इंटर्ड इन टू द दिल्ली दे रेन सेक दिल्ली they plundered they looted delhi they killed so many indians they set fire in the houses of delhi they poured out men women no commoners noblemen out of delhi from this incident mirza ghalib was very very sad he explained that there had been a city named delhi he explained that what was happening earlier today this was not per, that was not present he explained gulfarosan gulfarosan was a festival of flower that was not organized after 1857 revolt he remembered these incidents british wanted to demolish the past british as bahadur shah zafar was leader of 1857 revolt british captured bahadur shah zafar and sent him to burma to prevent further rebellion student british started british wanted to wanted the people to forget the Mughal past. They cleared all the gardens surrounding Red Fort. They filled the canals. They filled the water channels. Most of the mosques, mosque or masjid, were demolished. or they convert they were converted into another buildings here remember one thing that temples were left untouched why because british thought that it was muslim who were responsible for 1857 revolt Jinnat il Jinnat al Masjid was converted into bakery. In Jama Masjid, no prayer was performed in Jama Masjid for five years. A lot of changes occurred in Delhi. In eighteen seventy-seven, Delhi College was converted into a school and western part of world city where british and indian lived together was broken to expand delhi 
to allow railway track to be laid. And now British used to live in northern part of Delhi apart from India. Now they started living in civil line area which was very well laid out and full of water supply, fresh air, clean city. That's all. Have a nice day. Stay at home to fight with.